A Sioux Falls family has a unique story 10 years in the making. It involves a father, daughter, and broken down cars. And tonight's Island Kelland Renee Ortiz shares how some bad luck brought about some good fortune for one family. The same thing happened to a father that happens to a daughter in the same spot with the same guy. 10 years later. That's, yeah, 10 years apart. The irony, God works in mysterious ways. 10 years ago, Alan Unruh was traveling from Sioux Falls to Pierre. I got uh, partway there, and all of a sudden, my red oil light came on. It was 35 degrees below zero that night, and the only thing he could see was a sign that read White Lake, five miles. And my, my engine was steaming by then. He went to the only place still open at that time, a bar. And there was four angels drinking beer. They look like angels to me. One of the men called a repairman in nearby Kimball. And this Dan Overwig drove from Kimball to White Lake. And he opened my hood and he says, wow, the oil had shot all out. He said, you know, I got a new Buick, Buick LeSabre. Why don't I let you use my car? And I'll just fix yours and you can uh, drop mine off on your way back tomorrow. Flash forward to January of this year. I was traveling back home and all of a sudden on my car dashboard, I had some red warning signs. Unruh's daughter broke down in the same location as her dad. Shortly after, I uh, had a good Samaritan show up to help me. That Samaritan was Dan Overwick. He said, you know, I think what we need to do is just have you, I'm going to give you my vehicle. And I thought, wow, only in South Dakota would a guy uh, have a, give his new car to a stranger. I thought, what? type of person just loans out their vehicle to a stranger. All my life, that's what I've been doing. I, I, I don't know anything different, you know. We, we take pride in what we do and we try to just help people out. Overweg is the owner of Overweg LLC Repair and has been working as a mechanic for the last 35 years. In that time, he's helped his fair share of people. People are traveling up and down I-90 24 hours a day and there's sometimes you don't make it your problem, but 99% of the time we do. His shop and crew are what they call a one-stop shop. They work on everything from smaller cars to semi-trucks. Which makes it pretty diversified when, when somebody breaks down that somebody here can probably fix a car with the right expertise. Overweg says his acts of kindness are not done for the attention, but in the hope that people continue to pay it forward. And we need to have more people that care and, and help one another and not just not just uh, worry about me and you know yourself we got we got to care about everybody I want to be that good Samaritan you know that that example that Dan Overwig was to me I want to be that in my life to each and every person that I come in contact with with eye on Kelloland I'm Renee Ortiz in addition, all three of the individuals stress to always be prepared for the roads, get your car checked out, and make sure you and your car are equipped for the weather. You can find more stories about this on our website.